Here is the demonstration for the ecliptic using our classroom. In this demonstration, the light bulb at the center of the room will represent our sun and the globe will be a representation of the earth. Quite obviously, this model is not to scale as the earth would be very tiny compared to the sun and much farther away. Throughout the year, the earth orbits around the sun. But because we live on Earth, from our perspective, the sun seems to drift across the sky throughout the year. To understand our perspective versus what the Earth is actually doing, I have placed signs around the entirety of the room with months depicting where the Earth would be in its orbit at that time of the year. In between them, you will notice I had also placed the names of specific constellations. Those constellations would be far, far away in those same directions in the sky. If I were to simulate the orbit of the Earth from the perspective of the sun throughout, say, the month of June, July, and into August, this is what they would see. However, from the perspective of Earth, this is what the apparent movement of the Sun will look like relative to background constellations. This also has historical implications as many people associate their birth dates with these constellations. If you compare this list with the previous demonstration, you will notice that the direction of the constellations is not where Earth is in its orbit at that time of the year. Rather, it is the direction of the Sun as viewed from Earth at that time of the year. 